today we're gonna make a three ingredient pumpkin cheesecake bread yep three ingredients welcome to easy eatery our first ingredient is a box of spice cake mix and 100% pure pumpkin not the puree the pumpkin and it's a 15 ounce can and we're gonna mix both of those together now don't give up on it it's going to eventually look just like this it just takes a little while and it is kind of like uh looks kind of like a play-doh now let's grab our loaf pan i'm taking some parchment paper and i'm just going to kind of measure it down on the bottom to make sure it kind of comes up on the sides to make for easier removal but to get it to stick i wanted to add some um, spray oil or you can use butter and just spray the sides as well all right let's take our batter and we'll just kind of spread that all over the bottom and um, just kind of even it out a little bit now for our third ingredient we're going to use some cheesecake no bake cheesecake but we're going to bake with it so we're just going to add a couple little dollops in there and just kind of spread it out and then you can come up with a design that you like for it i went with more of a marbled look all right so we're going to bake it at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes and this is what we want it to look like we're going to do a toothpick check and just make sure that it comes out nice and clean and it does I only let it hang out for about five minutes before grabbing those little end pieces and transferring it over to a plate. I couldn't help it. It smelled, my house smells so good. So, all right, I just wanted to show you what it looks like on all sides. And plus I want to get that uh, parchment paper off of there. But look at there, you guys, it is nice. It's like perfection right there. It looks beautiful. Oops, I dropped a little chunk, I better eat it. All right, let's cut into it. I want to show you what it looks like on the inside. This smells absolutely amazing. I can't not wait to take a bite. You guys, look at there. Isn't it beautiful? Okay, totally gonna have to go for it. I like the end pieces because I like the little bit of crunch on the end of it, the little crust. All right, totally gonna go for it. You guys, all I can say is this is amazing. I still can't believe it was only three ingredients. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and please give the video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye now.